guys so as you can tell with the title I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different today I'm going to actually do my whole face makeup with just eyeshadow and for the base I'm gonna use an eyeshadow primer so it is still in that bit of eyeshadow so I guess without further ado let's jump on into this video all right so for the cover-up part because I do want to use all eyeshadows I'm actually doing my Lancome Le Base, my eyeshadow primer for my cover-up because it is in that shade. So I guess we're going to see how this goes. It's actually working not too bad. I actually kind of like it as a cover-up. Alright, so for an eyeshadow base, it actually worked pretty freaking good. So I guess I'm gonna find a shade that I can do for like a translucent powder now. Right, so I found one that will probably work for being a translucent powder and not make my face too white. So I'm gonna go in with my Smashbox one and I'm just gonna use this lighter color here. And I might mix it with a darker color just to see, because right now I look actually very, very pale. So we'll see how this goes. I'm not gonna lie, this feels really, really weird. I'm not used to this much powder on my face. All right, well, it's not perfect, but it works. I guess now I'm gonna try to find contour colors. All right, so for contour colors, I'm gonna be using my Morph eyeshadow palette, just cause it's got a lot of those neutral tones in it. I'm, hmm, I think I'm going to try to use this color here and pray it's not too dark. I might turn out looking like a clown or something, but we're gonna try it. It's a little bit darker than I want, but we'll work with it. I look like I've been really, really out in the sun right now. I look really tan. Okay, that might have been a little bit much. Okay, so that just happened and that is a lot but you know what not discouraged we're gonna keep going I don't know how like some YouTube makeup artists do this and make it look so great I'm starting to look ridiculous I look like I've been really, really, really in the sun a lot. I look like I've been like on vacation, which I guess not always a bad thing, but it is very, very dark. I'm gonna try to lighten this up a little bit by putting a little bit of this lighter color on top here, just over it, just to try to lighten it up a little bit because I feel like I am way, way dark. Actually, that helps quite a bit. Hmm. Actually, now it's actually turning out really nice. Hmm. Everything changes. I'm gonna just take a little brush and I'm just gonna do my nose and pray this doesn't come out weird. I'm gonna just take a little brush and I'm just gonna do my nose and pray this doesn't come out weird. Not bad. Now we're gonna go look for a blush color. Right, so I'm a little bit terrified to put this on, but I found this single Mark eyeshadow palette. So we're going to see, and hopefully it doesn't come out really, really pink, but 
We'll see. Actually, not too bad. Good job, eyeshadow. Alright, so that actually didn't come out too, too bad. I'm impressed. I actually kind of like the color it is. I might actually start using this eyeshadow as a blush now. <laughs> Alright, so now it's actually on to actual eyeshadow stuff. So let's go into this. So because I want to stick it with all eyeshadow, I'm not actually going to use my normal eyeshadow primer. I'm going to do the one that I used for a cover-up just to do a primer on my eyes. Life. Alright, so now we're going to do some color. Alright, so with my Morph palette again, I'm actually going to go in and I think I'm going to go in and do this color right here for my crease. Alright, creases are done. Now I'm going to take a different brush and I'm going to do this one here on the outside of my lids and then I'm going to do this one here on the inside of my lids. I definitely just closed the wrong eye there. I'm pretty sure you guys seen that. Oops. Alright, so eyeshadow we're good. Now we're going to try to figure out for eyeliner. So for a little bit of eyeliner, I think I'm gonna go in with my Essence Metal Glam. This one here, which is Chocolate Jewelry. That color right there to stick with the neutral kind of tones as well. So just a mini angled brush just to do my eyeliner. I just realized I need a mirror. Mirror has been located. If I can open it. So, all right, doing some eyeliner now. Not actually too bad for an eyeshadow. And then we're just gonna go with this color a little bit underneath as well. All right, for eyeshadow and eyeliner now, we're good. So I've decided for a highlight, I'm going to go in with the other Essence Metal Glam I have. This one is in Nice Frosting. So it's just a really white one. I'm going to go in and lightly put this on to do a little bit of a highlight. Works pretty good. Oh yeah, get that shine. Alright, we are shinied up now. Alright, so the hardest part for me was going to be trying to find something I could use for a mascara because I don't want to use just regular mascara. So I actually found this Avon Super Shock Black um, Gel Shadow and then I have just like a normal mascara wand that I'm going to see if this will work. It may not and I may just like wreck my, na or my eyelashes. But we're going to see if we can do it with this. I just got some on my cheek and I just rubbed it. Okay, minus my little cheek spot there. It doesn't seem to be working very well. So I'm going to go and try to work something else out for this. So as much as I didn't want to cheat with having to do mascara, I'm actually going to do normal mascara. So I'm going to use my Mega Effects Mascara by Avon. Just doing like one coat or so over top of my lashes. Just to kind of make it look like I have lashes. There we go. I cheated a little bit. But I had to, because I felt like I looked funny if I didn't put mascara on. 
So now we'll do some lips. So I am going to use a little bit of my Burt's Bees just to make the eyeshadow stick on my lips a little bit better. So now that I've got my Burt's Bees on, I'm going to go into my Maybelline Blush Nudes. And I'm going to go with the burgundy color. I just want to see what it looks like. Just taking a little brush and putting a little bit on my lips. I think I like this on lips. I think that's a really awesome color for lips. Plus it's shiny. I love it. All right guys, so this has been my full face makeup with only eyeshadow. I did cheat a little bit with my eyelashes because I just could not get the eyeshadow to go on to the lashes. So I apologize for cheating a little bit. But other than that, I think this was fairly a success. I look in my mirror and it doesn't look horrible. So it's actually not too bad. But yeah, if you did like this video, hit that thumbs up button and don't forget subs to subscribe to my channel. Just if you want to see all my other videos that I'm going to do, I'm going to do a video either every Sundays or Mondays, depending on how my work schedule works out. But when you do subscribe, don't forget to hit that little notification dude. He will let you know when my videos go live as well. And yeah, if you do like this video and want me to start to do a little bit other like full face makeups with like highlighter or anything like that, let me know and I will see what I can do for you guys. And yeah, once again, I hope you guys like this video and I will talk to you guys later. Uh -huh.